In this video, I'll walk you step by step through how to set up a website property in Google Analytics 4. First, you'll need to sign in or sign up for a Google Analytics account. So head over to the Google Analytics website at analytics.google.com and sign in. If you don't have an Analytics account, you can create one by clicking the Create Account link. Now, once you've signed in to Google Analytics, you'll need to click the Admin cog in the lower left corner of your screen. All right, now in the Property column, click the blue Create Property button. Next, fill in your property name, your time zone, and your currency. And once you're finished, just click Next. Then on the next screen, fill in your business details. So use the drop down and select the type and size of your business, and then click Next. On the next screen, you'll need to select the topic that best fits your objectives. So choose from the selection and click Create. Then on the next page, you'll need to choose a platform. So since you're using WordPress, click Web. Next, type in the URL of your website and a name that you'll easily recognize in Google Analytics. Now in the Enhanced Measurement option, move the toggle to Off. And when the pop-up window appears, click Turn Off. And then you'll need to click Create Stream. Now the Web Stream Details window will automatically open along with the Installation Instruction window. So close both of those windows by clicking the X in the upper left-hand corner of each window. Then on the Start Collecting Data screen, click Next. Now a window will appear indicating that your data collection is pending, so click the Continue to Home button. Next, you'll need to click the Admin cog in the lower left corner of your screen. Now in the Property column, click on Data Settings. And then click on Data Retention. Now click the drop-down menu and change the setting from 2 months to 14 months. And once you're done, just click Save. Now you've successfully set up a property in Google Analytics 4.